what's happening. Just a little movie there made real quick in Blender. I want to show you this neat little tool that's been added to Blender since revision 46063. It's called uh, Wireframe Tool and uh, it comes from B Mesh or it's part of B Mesh and it's kind of neat. Um, let's show you how it works here. All right, this is uh, this is the unit, and uh, if I ever get clicked on there, all right. See, this is the unit. See, it's actually made up of individual faces, and um, it's pretty cool. And you see, it just kind of wraps around faces around your your edges. And I'm going to show you how to do that real quick, just because I thought it was so neat. And let's start a uh, new one. Alright, uh, spacebar, add, mesh, UV sphere, and let's tab in the edit mode. And now hit, uh, um, I'm going to hit W to bring up the specials menu, and then I'm going to hit bevel. And then now you see how you move your cursor will determine how far the bevel goes. And then let's just do that. Now all I've done is just created a bunch of new vertices and, and edges and faces. So now to go to the uh, wireframe tool, hit Control F, and it brings up the faces menu. And you can see right here you got wireframe. And you say, oh, wireframe, insert new faces into the selected faces. Boom, you, I've done it, and there it is. Um, if I could control Z back and let's control Z how I actually made the uh, the unit that you saw is I uh, deleted a couple faces X delete the faces okay now I've got this unit here and then uh, select all W bevel and uh, beveled it and then I went to the Control F face selector menu with all the options wireframe and that's how I got that or pretty similar it's a little bit different now but uh, anyway I thought that was pretty cool and I thought I just wanted to share that with you you can do a bunch of neat stuff with this and if you just look at this it is just so cool it's like uh, I mean you can make all kinds of spaceships with this I love it. Anyway, quick tip for you there, and there it is, and I hope you enjoy it. Um, hope you don't think I was too boring this time. I did drink a little bit of coffee before starting this tutorial, so there you go. Hope you enjoyed it.